Hi, Cancer. Let's do a collective reading for you today. So today is the 17th of October, 2024. But whenever you watch the video is when you're supposed to be receiving the messages. Messages for Cancer. The Eight of Swords. You feeling alone? The Ace of Cups. The Hierophant. The Chariot. The Four of Cups in the center of your reading. The Nine of Wands. The Six of Swords. The Three of Pentacles. The King of Pentacles and the Queen of Wands. On the back of the deck, Cancer, you've got the Page of Swords and you have the Five of Cups. Okay, let's grab out your clarifiers and we'll get stuck into it. The Eight of Swords. As I said, you could be imprisoned in your mind over something, but we'll, we'll grab out clarifiers and see what's going on. What is the Eight of Swords for Cancer? The Three of Swords. There could have been some type of misfortune, a third party situation, a heartbreak, and the moon. Something where you didn't see the truth, you didn't see it all, it's something you don't want to leave, you're in your emotions about it, but spirits are telling you you do need to get out of your emotions and move forwards with the moon. Yeah, you may be feeling a bit depressed. <clears throat> but you can take the blindfold off. You know, you can get yourself out of this mode. What is the Ace of Cups? The Ace of Swords. So there's a new beginning here in your life. It could be a new beginning as a business ship. It could be a relationship. You've got the Ace of Cups. The Ace of Swords and the King of Cups. So there could be an energy coming in. Could be someone you're married to with the King of Cups. Water energy could also be significant. This is someone coming towards you. Wanting a new beginning. As I said, water energy could be significant. This person could be someone that is balanced in their mind and heart someone that knows when to use their emotions someone that's not afraid to use emotion <clears throat> this person sees you stuck okay and they're coming they're coming in to put a smile on your face what is the hierophant for cancer so this is in the recent past everyone's timeline is going to be a little bit different you've got the six of swords I feel like this is going to take you into a new world. This is going to bring in stability. You've got the Eight of Cups. Yeah, this is going to be something that is... There's a person here helping you move into a new world, okay? You're closing a cycle out, I feel, also. But there's something about starting a new world. You could be walking away from a relationship and this person's helping you. They're taking you. So you have the chariot coming out next, Cancer. That is your card. Let's see what the chariot is for you. What's the chariot? The seven of pentacles. The hermit.
and the hanged man. Okay. So even though you are moving forwards, even though you're moving on, okay, you're moving into some type of new journey or new world, um, there is travel here with the chariot cancer card. You're still not feeling 100%. Okay, I feel like you're still thinking about the past. Someone that could be vegging out, someone that's still feeling stuck, feeling the emotions. As something moves in the distance. Okay, I think it's moving further and further away. But it's like you're still holding on to it. What is the Four of Cups? As to why I feel like you sit in this Four of Cups energy, Cancer. There's like an opportunity in front of you and there's this feeling of being in your emotions about something. You've got the Queen of Cups. What's the Four of Cups? And the Star. Yeah, there's some type of wish fulfillment. There's someone here. You've got the Queen of Wands, Fire Energy, Leo, Aries, Sagittarius. This person's ready. This person's ready to go on this new journey with you, this new cycle. I feel like you've got to let something go. You've got to let something go or you could miss this opportunity. This person's not going to hold on forever. They see that you're in this energy of not feeling well. There's someone that's trying to put a smile on your face. What's the nine of wands for cancer? Justice. And the Ten of Swords. Keep going, Cancer. Okay, take this as a lesson and keep going forwards. Stop holding on to it. Divine's telling you to keep moving forward. You've got the nine of wands. You are the wounded warrior. Your balance, your justice is going to come in. You just need to cut that out. you got to remember this person. I feel there was something about a betrayal, okay? Someone put ten swords in your back. This could have been over, over a period of time. But they're out of your life for a reason, there's this new opportunity that's in your face. It's right in your face. It's right under your nose there. What is the Six of Swords? So you're still mourning that loss, but it does take time. It takes time to heal. What's the Six of Swords for Cancer? The Two of Wands. Really looking at things now. And you have the six of wands. Looking at things, grabbing that wand, like grabbing the steering wheel, okay? You are in control of your own life and you're driving yourself straight to victory. I feel like you're breaking free from the chains. There was that chain. I feel like you still feel a connection to this person from the past. You could have been with them for a long time. You know, months, years. But whatever this new choice is that you see in front of you, I feel like you open your eyes and you grab that opportunity. It's going to lead to success, okay? It's going to lead to much more in your life. What is the Three of Pentacles? So there is something new you're working on here. What is this Three of Pentacles for Cancer? The Page of Swords. So yes, something new, as I said, it could be with another energy. With the Three of Pentacles, you do need those other opinions. And then you've got the Ten of Cups. Okay, you're going to build a stable, happy home. Things may not be peachy keen for so long, Cancer, okay? But 
there's happiness in the near future here now that you are choosing to work on something with somebody in your life this could be a family there could be three people involved this could be something platonic it could have something to do with work but this is going to bring in a lot of happiness a lot of stability these people are helping each other so you have the king of pentacles and the queen of wands here let's see what this is for you cancer what is this for cancer what is the king of pentacles and the queen of wands the chariot this could be a child could be a younger energy could be someone that also has cancer in their chart like you and you've got the knight of pentacles so this is someone that's going to be reliable you see that they're reliable they're bringing in stability there's someone that could have a bit of money they could be a boss but i feel like they come out as this king of pentacles you come out as the queen you're someone that's desiring something and I feel like you're desiring this person and you're going forwards towards them and they're coming towards you, bringing an equal exchange here. Virgo energy could be significant. There's a new journey. There's a new path. There's a new path in your life, Cancer. That you weren't paying attention to, but you see it now. Let's do these two cards on the back of the deck for what you don't see. What is the Page of Swords for Cancer? Justice. The Ten of Wands. Once you drop those burdens, this new thing in your life, like it's here, and you've got the Eight of Cups, you need to let go. You need to let go of those burdens to bring this new beginning in. You've got the Ace of Cups. You need to let go. It is hard. It is hard to let go of something that you gave a lot to. What is the Five of Cups? The Nine of Cups. The Three of Pentacles. What you don't see behind you is a wish fulfillment, is your stability. What is the Five of Cups? A King of Wands. Someone that's coming to celebrate with you. Could be a family member. This could be a reconciliation. I don't feel like it's the past, past energy. I feel like it's a new beginning with somebody that you may have not even been in a relationship with. They may just be in your energy. But that's what you don't see behind you is this wish fulfillment. You need to let go of those emotions. Cancer, let's just grab you out a music message now and we'll close the reading. One card for Cancer. Solid Rock, Goetta. So listen to that song. It will have messages. Cancer, I'm going to leave it there. Thank you all for coming to my reading. If this is your first time, welcome. Just remember all my readings are timeless. So if you ever want to check out my channel, there is a playlist for cancer. I'm also doing personal readings. So if you'd like a personal reading from me, check out the link in the description below. But I love you all so much. I hope you all have a great day and I'll see you all again soon. Bye-bye.